Hey Jippies, welcome to the first episode of Road to Being the Best. As I'm brand new, there won't be a giveaway here yet. Instead, comment your in-game names below and let me know what your current goal on ICOV RSPS is. I decided to start my account by choosing standard mode, it seemed to fit good for a noob like me. I'm going to be doing some thiefing to start my grind out. Seems like they're a very easy way to get total levels and starting cash to buy more starter weapons and armor. Is Stopping training thiefing at level 50, I had enough cash for now. I left and went to Chaos Druids for the herb drops and easy melee experience. After upgrading to rune armor, next up was to head on over to sand crabs as they don't hit as much and they got quite a bit of HP. Ikov has the number one RSPS player base right now. The update logs as you can see really reflect why the server is doing so well. 
They've implemented a lot of very balanced tweaks lately, so it's worth giving it a glance. I used to play Ikov 1 as a kid. I was always at the gambling zone so I had to come see what they had done with it. I was really happy to see that they're still very popular. I will be showcasing some gambling of my own when I get through with a couple episodes. I wanted to get the requirements to do winter tot, which was 50 fire making. Going over to Lumbridge and chopping trees seemed to be the move right now. Taking a break from some skilling, I wanted to try one of my favorite all-time RS minigames, Soul Wars. Not many servers have this nowadays. This can bring me combat experience, rewards from the points, and even a fun alternative way to train. Camping the Fire Fiends seemed to be a good way to I could contribute to the team and contribute towards winning with my low stat.
I'll stop using my head, using my head, let it all go. Got you stuck on my body, on my body, like a tattoo. After some soul wars, it was time to continue the progress towards Winter Todd. Burning all the logs I got from woodcutting in Varrock got me level 50, which is what I needed.
Next up, it was time for some Slayer. I wanted to train the skill for multiple reasons. Combat experience, Slayer experience, and I need to collect charms for my summoning. My favorite skill on Ikov when I used to play as a kid was summoning. I'd love to max that stat as soon as possible. It's a very helpful skill here. Although my combat stats are still pretty low, I will decide to try my new task which was 47 Black Demon. Realizing I was too weak for my Slayer task, I decided to head on over to some lower level mobs with bigger HP. Experiments are what I chose. Money while you sitting around wondering why it wasn't you who came up from nothing. Made it from the bottom, now when you see me, I'm stunting. And all of my cars are with a push of a button. Telling me I changed since I blew up or whatever you call it. Switch the number to my phone so you never could call it. Don't need my name on my shirt, you can tell it I'm ballin'. Swish, what a shame, could have got picked. Had a really good game, but you missed your last shot. So you talk about who you see at the top or what you could have saw. But sad to say it's over for. Phantom pull up, valet, open doors. Wish I go away, got what you was looking for. Ask me who they want so you can go and take that little piece of shit with you. I'm out of Again, just upgrading to an easier place to train and using some of the cash to invest in Abyssal Whip to help with the levels. could write you a song to make you fall in love I would already have you up under my arm I used up all of my tricks I hope that you like this but you probably won't you think you're cooler than me you got designer shades just to hide your face and you wear them around like you're cooler than me and you never say hey or remember my name and it's probably cause you got your high brow shoes on your feet and you wear them around like it ain't shit. but you don't know the way that you look when your steps make that much noise. Every now and then throughout the episode, I would go back to the gambling zone to check how active it was. It always seemed to be popping and just made me even more excited to check it out in the future. Finally, it was time to take on these black demons. It was in the wilderness, but the players seemed to be just PVMing thankfully. The demons had good eligible drops and charm drops, so that was a plus one. You got your high brow, switching your walk in. You don't even look when you pass by, but you don't know the way that you look when your steps make that much noise. Shh, I got you all figured out. You need everyone's eyes just to feel seen behind your makeup. Nobody knows. Fall in love, I would already 
under my arm. I used to follow my tricks. I hope that you like this, but you probably won't. You think you're cooler than me. You got designer shades just to hide your face, and you wear them around like you're cooler than me. And you never say hey, yo. Remember my name, and it's probably. Attack level of 80, you can wear chaotic weapons. I'm going to be passively training dungeoneering to work towards the longsword or the rapier. I wanted to try my first ever dungeon here by myself, so I decided to solo the easiest dungeon. Didn't have much trouble with it though.
Killing the final boss and completing the dungeon got me 1.1k experience and got me to level 10. I'm sure as I skill I'll learn the dungeons and be able to complete them quicker. I received 117 tokens for the solo dungeon. Forty-three prayer is essential for most. Protect melee will negate a lot of damage and food use at a majority of the mobs. Using my remaining cash on bones and heading over to the player-owned houses to use the guild at altar, I achieved forty-five prayer in the end with a total level of six hundred and thirteen. Guys, Ikova's really brought back some of the core RSPS memories from me, and I will be releasing a lot more episodes soon. I hope by next video I will have a giveaway item for you guys. Comment your in-game names if you want to add me. I'd love to make some friends on the server. I hope to see you guys online.